I'm back. I'm. What's up, YouTube? I'm back with another freaking video. It's your girl, Queen Romy. Make sure you like, subscribe, tell a friend, tell a friend, tell a grandma, tell a grandpa, because you know Romy's out in. But this video is simply, I'm all natural, everything, just I, I want to be pure. Um, I don't want to have no filters, should I say, like makeup, nails, hair, nothing, I'm in my car. Um, so I just want to explain to you guys or not explain to you guys, but I just want to talk and send my condolences. Um, as you can see, it looks like I want to tear up in this video because there are so many people that are losing their life, y'all, and people aren't taking it serious. It is very serious. People are losing their loved ones. Okay, you understand what I'm saying? Like they're losing their love. I took notes. I have I watch the news every morning, so I just took some notes down that kind of like stuck out to me um, for the last two days. So that means today is Friday, so Thursday and Wednesday. I looked at the news and I was just like, "This is troubling because what are the years are going to come? You know, come with all this stuff." Um, and there's so many, they said it was like, like 7 million people or so like are sick or that have caught as a whole the coronavirus. It is very serious and we must wear our mask. I go to different stores, you know. And they be like, I ain't putting on my mask. I be like, why? You're not even protecting yourself or you're not protecting your child. You're not protecting those those around you. That is selfish. And, you know, America is selfish. I, I definitely can say America is selfish, you know. Um, y'all, y'all see me yawning in the inside. But a very, especially, you know, people that aren't willing to accept change. You know what I'm saying? Um, in which I understand because there's some things that I do not like to change. And I, you know, I had to make a sacrifice to change and some stuff within myself, around me, friends, um, you know, everything. So it, you, it's, it's always a possibility of change. And right now we are in a changing state of mind as a, as a nationwide, like, there, there are people dying in all countries, not just here in America, like all countries. Like they are not taking this as serious as it should. And it's crazy. My hometown, Ohio, represent O H I O. No, but we represent Ohio. Um, they like are about to get shut down. Because they're not paying attention to what reality is thrown in our face. We must put on the damn mask. It's not going to kill you. Wear the damn mask. Get masks that fit your skin protection. Get masks that fit for you. Ask your doctor what fabric you can use for making your sinus an allergy. Believe me because I know there's certain fabrics that I cannot use because it makes me sneeze or it breaks me out right in here. So find the correct one that fits for you. There have, look, there are millions of people selling face masks. You can definitely get a face mask. Hell, they giving them away for free at the hospital. Use that same one and go home, put something over it. You know what I'm saying? But I just truly want to send my condolences to the families that have lost their loved ones, that aren't, aren't able to hug their loved ones, aren't able to mourn with their loved ones, aren't able to see them on their last days of them breathing and things like that. That is very important. Um, I know so much what that's like. My mother did not die of COVID, but not seeing a loved one before they close their eyes sometimes can put up 
put an effect on you. You know what I'm saying? You you may not see it right now. You may not feel it right now. But wanting to say those last things that you had in your mind or in your heart that you wanted to get off your chest to say to the next person or say to your loved one, um, that plays a big part. You know, that 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 that, that it's a little heavy on a person. And like for mothers and children that are dying and not able to hold their babies or hold their moms. Like I understand. I feel your pain. I feel your pain. I am praying for you. So I definitely want to have a moment of silence for those people. So everybody who's watching this video, please just take a moment and just silence. Thank you, Jesus, for covering us. Thank you for those that took that moment with me and remembering those people that have lost their loved ones, those that have not able to, that aren't able to come home. Thank them, love them. We have to live in our presence. Please wear your mask. It is okay. If you need a mask, reach out to someone. You know someone that knows someone that knows someone that knows someone to get a mask. Believe me, people are more welcome to giving you masks than holding back. I'm seeing a lot of people on YouTube not wearing your mask. I see them when they do. I see those that um, wear their masks when they go to certain places and other people on their in their freaking YouTube be bashing why you got a mask on. Why you ain't got a mask on is the problem. Why you ain't got no mask on is the damn problem. So just wear your mask. Keep your vitamins up. You know, love on the vitamin D outside when the sun outside. And also, you guys, take care of your immune system. That is the huge part about this coronavirus. Making sure your immune system is up to par. Go to your doctor. Get a checkup. Um, I am one in... in um, look, my hand and my rings are backwards. I am the one um, that is putting in to go to the doctor to check up on myself, do a checkup. Um, and I'll definitely take you guys with me when I um, actually go. They setting out appointments very long. So when I go through that process, I will definitely let you guys know and let you guys in with me. But definitely check your immune system. Make sure your immune system is the way that it need to be to fit your body because everybody's immune system is different due to the fact uh, the, due to the fact of body facts, weight differentiality, um, you know, um, being diabetic, um, being diabetic type one or two, having high cholesterol, having all these other things that can possibly potentially happen to your body. So just make sure you stay on your immune, stay on your immune system and always remember to pray for those that aren't praying for you pray for those that are around you pray for those that are still that have done you wrong pay for those pray for those people and i want to end this video here i am once again sending my all my condolences to those that have lost their loved ones in this pandemic that we have received in 2020 and we are going to win as a nation Tell a friend, tell a friend, tell a grandma, tell a grandpa, put them damn mask on, and then we can go. Peace out.